Look, I realize that I might have a bit of a reputation for hating occult sims, and I do, don't get me wrong, I, I do hate occult sims. It's mostly just the vampires though, and it's not like because the vampires are bad or anything, the vampires are just really annoying. There's only so much of Vladdy Daddy coming to my front door and saying I have a nice neck that I can handle, and I'm not a huge fan of when occult sims like interrupt my everyday gameplay. At least I didn't used to be, I'm kind of changing, I sort of like the idea of getting abducted by aliens and stuff now. I think I'm becoming a bit of a more chaotic sims player than I used to be when I was younger, and I realized that I haven't made an alien sim in so long. Honestly, I'm not even sure that I could name one alien sim that I've made, so I kind of want to do that today. Aliens are actually quite cool in The Sims 4, and also it's a good opportunity to use some cast things that I don't get to use very often. But first, I want to give a quick thanks to our friends over at Case Defy for sponsoring this video. We've been sponsored by Case Defy before, and I've been using this case literally for months because it's so cute, but they sent me some more. This is like an unboxing now, but look at this one, it's got strawberries on it. I also got this little dinosaur one, and you can customize like so many cases on their website. So look, I made this one. It says Simsy in little rainbow font, but perhaps even better, I made this one. Um, it just says rat a bunch of times. I thought about putting my initials, but they're literally KMS, and I thought maybe I shouldn't do that in a sponsored video. I mean, it's my name, but like, rat's better. Oh, look, I just put it on. It's so cute. I'm so excited about this. You have no idea. I've been like waiting for these. Oh, I need to paint my nails. They look bad next to my case. Yikes. Okay, ignore my chip nail polish. One of the things that I love the most about Caseify is their drop to zero program. All of these cases that I picked out are made out of 65% recycled materials. You can send in any old cases that you aren't using anymore, and Caseify will ground them up and then use them to make new phone cases. Cases. For example, this strawberry case is made out of recycled materials and it's so cute. Their cases are also really durable and I drop my phone like all the time. It's kind of embarrassing, so I need that. And because I'm so clumsy, my phone cases kind of start to show like wear and tear after a while, but I've had this case on since November. You can't even tell like on the corners at all. It still looks brand new. I'm seriously a big fan of Caseify, so if you're in the market for a new phone case, you can go to caseify.com forward slash Lil Simsy and you'll get 15% off your order. That link is down below if you want to grab it. And thanks again to Caseify for sponsoring this video and thank you for my shiny new phone cases because I really, really, really like them. Anyway, let's game, shall we? Oh my god, I pressed this button instead of the stupid occult one. Okay, sorry, not stupid occult. We're being nice and positive today. I pressed the story mode button instead of the great occult button. Okay, I'm sorry to this sim, but I'm going to delete you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, add alien. I'm not really sure what kind of vibe I'm going for with this alien. I don't think that I want to dress her in like alien clothes though. I kind of want to try and pick some different outfits that are more interesting than just like the robo suit. Oh, wait, with the sliders, we can kind of customize the skin tone a little bit as well. That's kind of fun. I think I might go blue. Honestly, I haven't played with aliens in so long. I kind of forget what sort of ear options we have even. I want to get like giant eyes. I don't know which ones. Is that as big as I can make them? Why? There really are some interesting eye swatches, huh? I kind of forgot about that. Maybe the purple ones will be cool. Maybe she has a little tooth gap. That's fun. We also have lots of like scars and stuff from the other packs that I haven't used really. I think I'm probably gonna base most of it on makeup though. We really do have some interesting makeup options. I mean, look at how cool that looks. Ooh, I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that at all. No, not that either. Ugh. The eyeliner options just look messy. Like all of them just look kind of weird. I think I like that. Oh, I want this to be blue, but I, I can't get it to be the right shade exactly. Maybe I won't do any cheek makeup then. Maybe I'll just do the eyes. We could probably pick some kind of interesting lip color too. Can I get that to match the eyes a little bit better? That's fun. I like her. I wonder what I'm gonna name her. We'll get to that. <laughs> we'll figure that out. Maybe she's really strong. I don't know. I mean like are aliens like really buff or something? I don't know. <laughs> I think I like the idea of that. I'm not sure. We'll figure it out. Clothing wise, truly no idea. Not a clue what I want to do. I don't think this is the right color scheme. I like the idea, but I want it to be like a brighter pink. Wait. Oh, maybe some of the stuff from that kit would work. That is very bright. <laughs> Never mind. I'm not sure about that. This one might be interesting though. The color scheme is right. <gasps> I can pick fun fingernails too. You see, what kind of shoes do aliens wear? This is where I'm like, I don't know how to dress her. Maybe I'll pick her traits first and then go off of that. Because if we did like some random likes and dislikes. Okay, we don't like white. I think we can say she likes pink and blue though. I, I think that much is clear. We like romance music. Apparently wellness. No, I'm sorry. That's boring. <laughs> We're not doing that. Maybe she's like really interested in cooking. She's like, how do humans do that? Then then there's silly little grilled cheese. And maybe like fishing. She wants to know about the weird little fishies on planet earth. I don't know. That's a stretch. And rocket science because we're an alien. There you go. 
<laughs> I wonder what traits would randomize. Do you know what? Honestly, cat lover is kind of, that kind of fits the vibe. Maybe genius. And how about like a little bit paranoid? Just a little bit. And maybe her aspiration can be fish related. Because <laughs> she came to Earth to find the fish. Does it randomize good alien names? Sage, Rochelle, Gem? <gasps> Gem! Oh, that works! I'm gonna make her last name something gem related as well. I just randomized through like 50 different last names, could not find one that I vibed with, so I just googled types of gems and um, that one works. I'm not sure if I love this outfit still, so I need to think about it a little bit more. Do you know what? I do think that this throwback fit kit stuff could work. Um, does it not come in a matching swatch? Oh, that must be the matching swatch. Oh, maybe she could wear that. I won't lie to you, I'm getting like a little bit of Xenon vibes. Do aliens wear socks? I don't know. Maybe not? Maybe no socks? Do aliens wear jewelry? <laughs> like, I'm not sure. I mean, we're the ones inventing this, so I can do whatever, but I don't know. No, I'm having fun right now, can you tell? Maybe I do like a cult. No, I, I should shouldn't say that. Let's not make any wild claims prematurely, but maybe, just maybe, I like them. <gasps> this is cool. Oh, we should use that for one of her outfits. I haven't really used any of the throwback fit kit stuff that much. I feel bad that I keep making her wear all this makeup like all the time, but in my head it's not makeup. She just looks like that. Okay, would it be funny if she just wore like completely normal pajamas? Like we're kind of trying to go for this like alien vibe with her other clothes that's like super bright colors, xenon-esque, and then it's just like normal pajamas. Her other clothes are normal too. Like people would wear those. <laughs> A lot of people would wear those. But I think you get what I mean that like, we're trying to go for this like super bright colorful thing. Oh, there is some really interesting makeup, huh? I kind of forget about most of this. Do you dare me to use this? I never use this. Maybe I'll put that on for her party wear. I kind of like it. It's just kind of fun. Okay, but for her swimwear, I think we should go like all out and give her like a wetsuit. Wetsuit, flippers, even like a snorkel. Cause remember she's trying to study the fish, so she'll need this. <laughs> it's kind of cute. This is under the hot weather category and I kind of like it. It's a dress. What if she just wore that? Okay, I know we talked about this. I want to wear it so bad. I really like it. I don't really know what to pair with it. Maybe that, it works. She doesn't need like regular cold weather clothes. She's an alien, she doesn't get cold, it's fine. All right, I think her alien version is done. Oh, I forgot nails, wait. I don't love this outfit. <laughs> Maybe I should redo this. That'll work. It's fine. Oh, maybe she could put a hat on. Uh, her ears clip through the hat. Maybe not. <laughs> All right, well there, there. That can be her alien version done. I wanna give her like a really unassuming human version. I mean, we could probably go with the other traits. Like we could have her still be like a very fishy kind of person. <laughs> I don't know, like very outdoorsy, I guess. Like, do you think that she's cute? This is kind of a different vibe than I was originally going for, but that might work. Honestly, it's an impressive description guys. I like her. I think she's really cute. I like really, really, really like this outfit. Oh my god. <laughs> Why do Sims do this? This is giving alien vibes though. Like the fact that she put on every accessory possible. She was like, hu humans like accessories. Okay, glove, bracelet, bracelet, socks, necklace, earrings, piercings, hat. Like, she was like, this is human, right? We wear everything, right? She learned about the existence of gloves and she had to embrace it. I wonder, does this hair from the new pack look kind of like this hair? Like, could that pass as the same person's hairstyle? They're different colors, but I think it could work. I love that blue dress. Maybe some light pink nails. I might actually give her like a ring and stuff. Honestly, let's just go all out. You want some pretty jewelry? Why not? Oh, this one's cute. I like that. Is there a gold version? Cause that's what her other jewelry is. I think that works. I think we should give her some throwback fit kit clothes. It's like an ode to her true self, you know, to wear some throwback fit kit stuff for her athletic wear here when she's pretending to be a human. Oh, I wish they had given us a version of this hair without the, the bandana on it. I love it. I think it's so cute, but also like it's not realistic to wear that like everywhere. <laughs> and I wish that I had like another version that was more usable. Well, that and the fact that you can't change the color of it, like you just get kind of stuck with what you have. We have like the pattern and the no pattern, but it's always green. So you kind have to always base your outfits on that. I know I talked about like outdoorsy being the vibe for this sim. I'm not sure that's where this is going exactly. Don't get me wrong, she's very cute, but I was thinking like a different vibe when I first said that, like outdoor retreat clothes kind of vibes. I love this outfit, that's cool. I wear this in real life. Oh, maybe now we can have the throwback fit kit hat. <laughs> maybe we can make it work for this. We will find a way for her to wear it. Somehow, some way, we'll figure it out. That's cute, see? Oh, maybe we could give her like a bunch of sunscreen 
screen. Wait, I forgot this existed. I should check that for her alien self. But maybe we could give her like a bunch of sunscreen because she heard about the sun and she's all paranoid about it now because like she's from space, she's fine. When she's an alien, she won't burn. But when she's a human, she's not sure. This outfit from Cottage Living could actually make me cry. I'm not kidding. I love this outfit. It is hands down the best one. Okay, and last but not least, our cold weather outfit. I want to try and do something fun. I want to pick something different than normal because I always use the same stuff like over and over again. Granted, there aren't that many options, so that would be why. Oh, I do like this coat. This will be nice. Do we have any cute boots? Oh, I want to use these. That's perfect. Okay, there we go. I think she's ready. You know what? She's a very different sim as an alien and as a human, but I like her. Maybe I'll play with her. I have not played with aliens in this game in so long. I married one by accident in my legacy recently, but like I didn't make the alien and I didn't choose to play with her. She inserted herself into my family because I did not know she was an alien when I started dating her. But other than that, I haven't like actually played with aliens in a while, so maybe I should. Maybe I like a cult sims. I've changed. Oh no. I don't think anybody saw this day coming. Okay, I'm gonna put her on the gallery. I don't know what to call it. <laughs> I don't know. I made an alien? Alien dot 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 question mark? So if you want to download her, she will be up. I think I used a lot of packs, so for that I- oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, I used a lot of packs. Pretty much every pack. How did I even manage that? What is wrong with me? Look at this. That's absurd. Oh well, it was fun. And that's all that matters. I don't really do a ton of create a sim videos, so I thought it might be kind of fun to try this together. And you know what? I don't make a lot of occult. Maybe I should try and make a vampire and stuff next. I don't know. I will say I think mermaids are my least played with occults. Not for any reason. It's not their fault. Just the mermaids are like objectively the worst ones because they can do the least compared to the others. They don't even have the cool skill tree and stuff. I guess aliens don't either, but I don't know. I still think aliens are better than the mermaids. Thanks again to Caseify for sponsoring this video. Make sure you go to caseify.com forward slash lilsimsy, get yourself a case, and save 15% off. I've got that link down below if you need it. And with that being said, I'll catch you all tomorrow. Bye everybody. Do you know what? I think my favorite part of the sim is her makeup. I just never get to use a lot of that stuff, so it's kind of fun to branch out and try some different makeup options. Her eyeshadow is cool.